With the imminent launch of the Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 and 7 Ultra, Samsung has provided a sneak peek into the bioactive health sensor will be featured in the upcoming Galaxy Watch 7, which could be a lifesaver for some of the users. This sensor, integrated into Samsung's top smartwatches, is a powerful chip that combines various fitness and health monitoring sensors, such as the optical heart rate monitor, electrical heart signal tracking, and bioelectric impedance analysis. The latest version of the bioactive sensor boasts an enhanced design that creates more space on the chip, strategically positioned sensors for improved accuracy, and a range of colored LEDs in addition to the standard red and green ones. By optimizing the sensor placements and boosting the performance of each light-receiving photodiode, Samsung managed to fit more sensors onto the chip while reducing the number of photodiodes required to track the reflected light accurately. While most fitness trackers and smartwatches rely on optical heart rate sensors that shine light onto the skin and measure the reflected light to estimate heart rate, the addition of multiple LED colors, including red, could potentially enhance the accuracy of heart rate measurements on the Galaxy Watch 7. This innovation may help Samsung consolidate readings and improve the overall precision of the watch's health monitoring capabilities, offering users a more reliable and comprehensive fitness tracking experience. Samsung highlighted that the enhanced bioactive sensor will introduce the Advanced Glycation End Products AGES, Index, a metric linked to metabolic health and biological aging influenced by lifestyle and diet. The company hinted that this feature may not be available immediately upon launch, potentially awaiting regulatory approval before being rolled out. The primary goal of this sensor upgrade, according to Samsung, is to provide more accurate health insights. However, specific details about the capabilities of the revamped bioactive sensor in the upcoming Galaxy watches remain undisclosed as of the unpacked event. Samsung consistently references the sensor's integration into the next Galaxy watch, likely indicating the Galaxy Watch 7. Nevertheless, it is anticipated that the improved bioactive technology will also be incorporated into the Galaxy Watch Ultra, the premium model anticipated to debut at Unpacked. With the imminent launch of the Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 and 7 Ultra, anticipation is high for the new features that these smartwatches will bring to the table. One intriguing development that has caught the attention of users is the emergence of a sleep apnea detection feature on these devices. While the specifics of the new features are still shrouded in mystery, hints have been dropped over the past few months regarding what users can expect. Samsung's announcement in February about the FDA clearance for a sleep apnea detection feature hinted at exciting possibilities for the Galaxy Watch series. Recently, a Reddit user shared screenshots revealing the availability of the sleep apnea feature following an update to the Samsung Health Monitor app. This user, participating in the One UI Watch 6 Beta program, highlighted that the feature is compatible with the Galaxy Watch 4 and newer models. The Samsung Health Monitor app specifies that the minimum requirements for utilizing the new feature include the Watch 4 and Wear OS 5 with One UI Watch 6. The app requires at least two nights of data to detect signs of sleep apnea, monitoring relative decreases in blood oxygen to assess the severity of the condition. Despite the lack of extensive information from Samsung about this feature, its inclusion in the One UI Watch 6 Beta program suggests that it may debut with the Galaxy Watch 7 upon its public release. Following this, older watches will receive the full One UI Watch 6 update, albeit after some time. While the exact integration of AI into these features is still unclear, having this extra machine power opens up possibilities for new features and improved recommendations. In addition to this, Samsung has revealed a new chip that is expected to power the Galaxy Watch 7 series and the Galaxy Watch Ultra, with leaks suggesting that the upcoming smartwatches could feature a new 3NIM Exynos chipset for improved performance and battery life. Ahead of the launch of the Galaxy Watch 7, Samsung has officially introduced the Exynos W1000, its latest wearable chipset that will be integrated into the smartwatch. This new chip, fabricated on Samsung Foundry's 3MGAA, boasts a 5-core CPU with a big Cortex, a 78-core clocked at 1.6 GHz, and a low-power cluster of 4 Cortex of 55 cores running at 1.5 GHz, along with an ARM Mali G68 MP2 GPU supporting up to Quad HD resolution displays. The use of fan-out panel level packaging ensures better heat dissipation and a smaller size, 
while the newer CPU cores and advanced fabrication process are expected to make the W1000 more efficient than its predecessor. Samsung claims that the new CPU and GPU will deliver significant real-life improvements, with up to 3.4x faster single-core and 3.7x faster multi-core performance, as well as apps opening up to 2.7x quicker for a smoother user experience. With these advancements, Samsung's latest wearable chip is set to elevate the performance and efficiency of its upcoming smartwatches, promising an enhanced user experience for consumers. The chip's architecture represents a major improvement from the previous version, transforming it from a dual-core to a five-core setup, resulting in smoother task management. Concerns about reduced battery life compared to older models are addressed by Samsung, who promises better battery performance and faster charging. The inclusion of newer RAM technology is expected to enhance multitasking capabilities and overall longevity. Samsung also introduces a new 2.5D always-on engine to support detailed watch faces without significantly impacting power consumption. The chip's 32 gigs storage capacity indicates a doubling of storage for the upcoming Galaxy Watch 7 series and Galaxy Watch Ultra. It is highly likely that the new chip will be integrated into the latest Galaxy Watch lineup, including the Galaxy Watch Ultra, but may not be suitable for the Galaxy Ring due to size limitations. It seems like the Galaxy Watch 7 is ready to hop on the 15 watts charging train, providing a 50% speed boost compared to its predecessor. This is a significant upgrade, considering that Samsung's latest smartwatches, the Galaxy Watch 6 and Watch 6 Classic, max out at 10 watts charging. Based on certification documents, one of the Galaxy Watch 7 variants, SML305, is all set to support charging at 15 watts. Given that different model numbers usually represent regional variants, it's highly likely that the other three variants will also support this speedy charging. Now, let's talk numbers. The Galaxy Watch 6 typically takes around an hour and 30 minutes to charge from 0 to 100%. With the advancements in charging technology, the Galaxy Watch 7 should only need a mere 45 minutes to reach its maximum battery capacity. Of course, the actual charging time will also depend on the battery size, but for now, we don't expect any major changes in that department. Overall, it's exciting to see the latest developments in the Samsung Galaxy Watch series. With its familiar design and new color options, the Watch 7 is sure to catch the attention of smart watch enthusiasts. In the past, Galaxy Watch updates have been relatively minor, making it reasonable to purchase the current version shortly before the new one hits the shelves. But this time, brace yourself for some major updates. The potential for improved battery life alone is enough reason to hold off if you're eyeing a Galaxy Watch in the near future. Even if you're not particularly excited about the rumored new features or the enhanced battery life, keep in mind that the price of the Galaxy Watch 6 will likely drop once its successor is released. It's still a few months away, but if you can wait it out, you might just save yourself some cash. Now let's hear it from you. What are your expectations for the upcoming Galaxy Watch 7 lineup? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. And for all the latest updates, be sure to check out our channel. Until next time, peace out.